Hello, Master Dillo here. We want to thank you for becoming a recent member of Champions Martial Arts. We are excited about you or your child's journey on the way to Black Belt, and we just want to cover a few things of our policy and procedures and go over our new member packet that has some exciting features and benefits of our program. So first of all, if we have not already reviewed the policy and procedures with you, um, this will be the first sheet and the attachments that have been uh, given to you in this email. Um, the first part covers our calendars and activities. Basically, this just states if Canyon County School District is closed for holidays, most likely we will be closed as well. And then um, sometimes we have events uh, for the American Taekwondo Association, such as uh, rank testings, camps, tournaments, and other events like that. And we may be closed for those days as well. You'll always uh, be giving a notice on your app that you should be set up by now. Um, we'll no notify you via Facebook, and we'll also post notifications uh, in or around the studio. Um, our second uh, section there is on refunds and, and extend extension policy. Um, we don't refund on tuition. However, our extension policy is actually really exciting because if you're a member at a gym and you pay for the month, but you don't train that month, you get no credit for that um, month of training. However, martial arts is a little bit more of an investment, so we appreciate that. If you miss two weeks or more consecutively and you give us a reasonable notice within 30 days before or after um, your miss of classes, uh, we will actually credit that time to the end of your membership. So you always get credit for what you pay for. We can't stop and start memberships because that's a logistic nightmare for as many students as we have, but we will always give you credit for the time missed if it's two weeks consecutively or more. Just um, always notify us within a reasonable time. Um, the next section is ATA annual dues and ring testings. Uh, we are licensed with America Taekwondo Association, the world's largest martial arts organization. There is an annual fee for every member. Your first year is covered as part of your enrollment. But there after that, every year you will be charged a $49 annual membership fee to be a part of all the ATA events um, and of course our liability uh, insurance as well. So they're gonna send you a notification in the mail that says your ATA dues have expired approximately a year from now. Um, please don't send that to them. Just make your payment right here in the school so we make sure all that gets recorded uh, officially and on time. And then as far as rank testings, um, we will let you know. We have testings about every eight to 10 weeks and we're gonna notify you if your child or yourself is ready to rank test by a permission slip. Um, that permission slip is going to go over the uh, prices of the testing, the dates, times, and if need be, um, the uh, different ways to do a makeup testing if needed also. Um, the next part is drop-off policy. If our t uh, your student is a tiny tiger, a parent must be present in the facility at all times. Um, if for any reason you need to step out, take a phone call or anything else, just let us know so your child doesn't look up and panic because they don't see in the uh, parent spectator area. If your child is older than seven years old and you need to drop them off, run an errand, um, get another uh, child to an e uh, event or activity, we understand. Okay, we just ask you keep the drop off and pick up time within 10 minutes of classes, uh, before and after classes. Uh, this is for the safety of your child and we absolutely do not allow children to wait outside. They must uh, remain in the facility for their safety. If anything ever comes up, please notify us. Just give us a call, say, hey, I'm running a few minutes late so we can make sure they're attended to and um, stay in the studio safely. And then the next part says attendance. Um, you should be on the app again. There's um, um, the way to check in on the app. Um, just sign in, we, we've shown you how to do that. If not, um, we have different kiosks set, set up in the studio um, and you can check in manually when you're here. It's very imperative that you do check in your child or yourself every time you do take class because there are uh, certain, remark, uh, certain uh, required classes to uh, advance in rank each time. So approximately 16 classes is required to advance from rank to rank. And last part says social media posts. We do take pictures, videos um, in class, and we like to share those and share the story of what Champions Martial Arts is doing. And if you ever have a problem or see a picture you don't want posted, and you're, you or yourself, yourself or your child's in those pictures, just let us know. We'll immediately take those down. If you have any other issues with that, let us know. If you could just uh, take a moment, uh, next time you come into class, see us if you have not already. Initial each of these on our policy procedures, signing in data so we have uh, for our records. Uh, we certainly appreciate that. 
And next part is the student packet. Again, all these attachments are in the email uh, we provided. Um, they're in no specific order, so I'll kind of go through it in order. Um, the first part is the sparring gear package. So the, basically, the way we uh, do our classes each week is we have weapons one week, sparring the next. If your child is a tiny tiger, they take the first 30 minutes of class, and when your child is ready, they can stay and participate in the next 20 minutes, which on the schedule is labeled as advanced tiny tigers. That just means they're now ready to start training with the weapons or the sparring gear. Your student is not required to spar until they've been in for six months. So you have plenty of time to attain and make the purchase of the sparring gear. We understand that's a little bit more of an investment. We encourage use holidays, birthdays, get family involved, whatever you can. Um, and the sparring gear does last quite a while, lasts between a year and a half to two years. We size it up for them. We make sure everything fits and is the right size for them. The studio, or excuse me, the sparring gear does have to be purchased in our school. Um, when you make the purchase, it, we order it in. It takes about seven to 10 days to get in and we make sure everything fits absolutely uh, the way it's supposed to. The weapons can be purchased um, as needed. They're only 25 to $35 per weapon. We cycle every weapon every four months. Um, so once you attain the weapon, uh, you're going to use those weapons again a year from now because we cycle back through all of them. Um, and you're only having to pick up new weapons approximately every four months or so. Okay, uh, this next sheet is the sheet of um, all the testing uh, ranks and the prices that go with our rank testings. Um, the Tiny Tigers have one and then the kids and adults have one. This just lists all the different fees. The fees include the actual testing itself, includes the new rank, includes um, patches, headbands, all of that, certificates uh, that come with testing. Now the next uh, part that I'm going to go through is just some of the curriculum and things kids are required um, or students are required uh, to learn as they're going through uh, the ring. So Tiny Tigers, we have what's called the Tiny Tiger O. This is their first goal to earn their first stripe on their belts. The uh, children have, the children and adults have this Spirit of Taekwondo. That's this sheet here, okay, along with some basic ATA philosophy questions, okay. Once uh, these are memorized, student just needs to let us know in their next class, and then we can um, test them for their next rank. And then also in the next sheet provided is um, different philosophy for the tiny tigers, meaning of all the belts, meaning of all the animals. Just hang on to that because that's going to be um, material required as a advance in rank. They should all have a Songam 1, which is our first white belt form uh, sheet here that lists all the moves. Um, there are also practice videos on our website um, and on the app that we're working on right now that students could use to practice as well. Um, this is all the required um, meanings and philosophy for the students and, or excuse me, the children and adults. And then we have what's called the Victory Program. Um, becoming a member, uh, the children should all receive a bag tag. It's basically just a, a card sized little uh, tag with a little keychain hoop that they could put on their sparring gear bag eventually. Um, and this is like a program to reinforce positive behavior here at the studio, at home, and of course at school as well. So the way this works, if you flip the bag tag over, there's little sections that have stars on the back. We have five different bag tags. They um, start as white belt and their goal is to earn all the different colors until they finally achieve the gold bag tags. They are white, blue, red, black, and of course, of course gold. So it's kind of like a patch system like Boy Scout, Girl Scouts use uh, to reinforce positive behavior. Um, blue stars or stars we award them that are blue are for good behavior in the studio, at home. Um, at home, you can encourage good behavior by um, having them do the good deeds list. So whatever good deeds you uh, kind of uh, expect as good deeds, doing your chores, behaving, be, behaving uh, being respectful at home to siblings, whatever it is, as you sign off each day, um, have the students bring this in. When they bring their papers in of any kind, they just sit like they normally do, waiting for class, and then the instructors will come around, um, pick up the sheets, we'll put a star on it, we'll recognize them in class, and then we'll return the papers with them. Just take that star and put on the back deck. This is a practice sheet to encourage students practicing at home. All of our website information access the practice videos is right on there. And then of course, um, we have what's called a life skills progress report. This is a, a letter that goes to teachers. We encourage doing this at least every month. 
Um, it just holds them accountable for good behavior and keeping up with their classwork at school. Um, and then at the bottom, it also a letter to the teachers asking if um, they would like us to come in and do a classroom presentation. Your uh, child would be able to wear their uniform, uh, get to break a board for the class, and then we highlight them by maybe also having them doing their salon form or something like that. And then we talk to the classroom about good behavior, setting goals, uh, life skills that we learn through martial arts. Any other special awards such as uh, report cards, um, special academics like in 100% on a spelling test, that's a big achievement. Um, citizenship awards, anything like that. Have your children bring them to us. We want to reinforce good behavior at school as much as we can. So we'll give stars for pretty much anything. Um, as far as um, daily homework and uh, worksheets, uh, put them in stacks of 50. When they bring in and show us, hey, I'm doing my homework and it's a stack of 50, uh, we'll put a star on that as well. We're not going to count the papers. We trust your integrity uh, that they'll be in those uh, stacks of 50. Um, next part is our uh, spectator courtesy policy. We are one of the few martial arts schools that actually allow parents to be involved with classes. We don't put you behind a big glass wall and have you watch classes on a monitor or TV. We want you to be engaged and see firsthand what's going on in classes. But in that respect, we just ask you respect that um, the students need the full undivided attention of the instructors and vice versa. Um, so a couple things. First of all, we ask parents don't coach from the sideline. You could cheer them on, but don't say things like, hey, Johnny, bend your knee, or hey, Johnny, uh, pay attention, because that can be very distracting and disruptive. If you have little ones, um, I'm a father of three girls. I've been through all the uh, infant stage and toddler stage. I know they could be a handful. If they do get a little rowdy or start, start acting up, please take them outside until they've uh, calmed down and then bring them back in uh, when ready. Any toys or um, devices that have sounds or like trucks or cars that they roll around on the ground, they can be very loud and interruptive. So please uh, keep the toys to a minimum or keep the sound effects from the toys uh, completely turned off. Next part is our wellness policy. Um, pretty self-explanatory. If your students come in, they have a fever or show any symptoms of illness or sickness, we will not allow uh, students that are ill to step out on the floor or attend class. Sometimes parents like to bring them in and have them just watch class. Our advice is stay home. Stay home, get feeling better, come back in uh, when you're good and healthy and ready to go again. Our last part is birthday parties. Our birthday parties are super exciting here. Our instructors do a phenomenal job. Basically, um, you get to invite up to 30 kids. If you invite more, great. If more show up, there's just a little extra charge. But you get the studio for an hour and a half. You basically show up with the cake and the kids. The instructors do the rest. We, um, you can also add additional superheroes. We have five or six superheroes, Black Panther, Captain America, Spider-Man, um, Iron Man, Power Ranger, and you can have special superheroes show up to the birthday party as well. Your child gets to wear a black belt for the day. They get to break a board for the day. They get to cut their cake with a real samurai sword. It's safe. Mr. Benninger holds a sword with them. Um, but super, super exciting birthday parties here. Normally our birthday parties are uh, $199, but for your birthday party, as a uh, thank you for becoming a member of CMA, uh, you get $50 off. That's it. Again, thank you for becoming a member of Champions Martial Arts. We are super excited to have you and um, being on the journey of Black Belt with you or your child. Uh, we have a great family here. Get to know each other. Follow us on um, Facebook. Just look up Champions ATA Martial Arts. And then as soon as you can, join our CMA Parents page. Just type in CMA Parents. It's a uh, closed private group for our parents only where we uh, engage and interact and give more notifications of things going on. But that's it. I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart. Uh, our family uh, absolutely loves having you here and we look forward to seeing you in your next class.